All right. Now we're doing free code camp, JavaScript algorithms and data structures, basic JavaScript declare string variables. All right. So previously we used the following code to declare a variable. All right, just like that. Uh, but we can also declare a string variable like this. You know, it's exactly, pretty much exactly the same way we did on the last one, where we say, where we did this is the declaration and this is the assignment. So over here, just like that other one, this is the declaration and this is the assignment right here, all right? So our name is called a string literal. A string literal or string is a series of zero or more characters enclosed in a single, pardon me, in single or double quotes. So now we're going to create two new string variables, my first name and my last name, and we'll assign them the values of our first names or la and last names respectively. Uh-huh. Anyway, I'm definitely not going to be putting my name on this internet video, but we will do this. We'll say var my first name, all right? And that equals, that equals, and we'll just put A. How about that? And since I don't really feel like typing var twice, I'm going to show you the trick that I always use when I'm declaring variables, a little comma. And then right here, we can just say my last name now equals Z, A to Z. All right. Uh, and let's cap this off with a semicolon right there for best practice. Let's run the test. Looks good and submit it. All right. Now we're on to understanding uninitialized variables and we'll see you next time.